I'm joined by the sisters who are synonymous with YouTube style. It's Elle and Blair Fowler. Oh. Ladies, welcome to the show. So great Thank to you. see you here. You've been traveling the country. Oh, we just got back at midnight last night. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys are hustlers. You work nonstop. <laughs> so you're on the Today Show. What? You're doing mm -hmm. all for your new book, right? Yeah, Beneath the Glitter. We did Today Show, VH1, Big Morning Buzz. So it's been fun. It's so fun for us. It doesn't seem like work. Even though traveling's a little difficult, it's just so much fun. Yeah, and you've evolved so much as well. I mean, yeah. who knew you would have a book out? Was that always your goal to be creating all of this from we had, what you started out as YouTube videos? We had no idea. It started, we were in our bedrooms in Tennessee, just filming videos because we like to put on makeup and it turned into this, so. Yeah, it was unexpected, but like I said, I mean, it really is what we love and it's our passion, so it's really fun to be able to do that every day. You actually brought a surprise for all the yes. fans today. Yeah. We have this very special bag. And the top comment today on this video you're watching right now will get this very special bag and we'll tell you what's inside in just a bit later yes. on in the show. But first, we're going to talk a little bit about some style. Summer's over, unfortunately. Don't be sad, mm -hmm. really, please don't be. And Ellen Blair are here for their essential fall style tips. So let's start with that today. What do you have for us? We have tip number one, inverted braid. Yeah, it's super simple. Literally, all you do is take your hair on the side, divide it into three sections, and you start braiding. And most of the time when you're braiding, you kind of untangle the bottom because you think it's just going to be like a tangled up mess. But actually what it's doing is creating an inverted braid. So when you get to the tangle, you flip it so that it's not inverted and it holds the braid. So you don't even need an elastic. And you don't need an elastic. And I have no idea what this looks like because I don't have a mirror. No, and actually, really good. I have trouble actually creating regular braids. So I would like to try the inverted braids, yeah. see if I could even. So that's something that. it's, it's really quick and simple. You can do it as you're running out the door to go to school and you don't have to have anything with And you. it doesn't matter if it's messy because it's supposed to be messy. Yeah. It's an elastic list braid. It's the cool, messy look. Yeah. yeah. Now we have tip number two white eyeliner for tired eyes. Yes, now this is something I use almost every single day because I have insomnia, everyone knows it, I tweet about it all the time, so I always look tired. No, so you don't. I do, I do. I feel like insomniacs never look tired. Oh, That's they the do. Point, right? No, they look so tired. Because <laughs> we want to sleep, we just can't. So white eyeliner, or even a nude eyeliner on your waterline underneath just kind of whitens up that red eye you might have and makes you yeah. look more awake. Do you have a type of eyeliner that you recommend? Lately, I've been using NARS Larger Than Life mm -hmm. eye pencil. It's not as white as like a bright, bright, like blue white. So it just gives you like a warm tone. I like blue white because then it really makes the <laughs> whites of your eyes whiter. I like it. And what about for brown eyes? How do you brighten up brown eyes? Anything, I mean, and nude, even a yellow. Even a yellow, it yeah. It sounds yellow. so weird, but like mm -hmm. a banana colored inner waterline color. Anything that you put right on your inner waterline, it's just gonna open your eyes up. Except that if much you use more. black, and then it closes it. Yeah. Which is good for like smoky, sultry eyes. For sultry eyes. What could the guys do? Should they be doing this too? Guys are more into <laughs> liner than you think these days. If you're a pirate. <laughs> <laughs> or emo, you know, whatever. Yeah, you know. a rock right. star. Tip number three, lip and cheek stains which I know about this, but this is just something good to have in your bag, right? Yeah, especially for school. I mean, if you're running to school, you don't want to carry around a lot of makeup. You might not have room for it. You don't want to tote it around all day, and it's quick. You know, when you're in between class, you run to your locker, you have two seconds to kind of primp. It's just something you can add a little bit of cheek color, a little bit of lip color, and look more refreshed. Yeah, look alive. Yeah. yeah. So, it or like a vampire, because like vampires have red lips. And I say they're still in, even though they're like two years ago. It's the updated version of Twilight. What, uh, which one do you recommend? Because there's I so many like out there. I the Bobbi Brown one, and also Laura, uh, Laura Mercier has mm. a really great one that I like. And I think just finding a color that kind of suits your skin tone. And then I like it because it also gives you a little bit more of a dewy look on your skin, so you don't look so, like, dried out. But not so. dewy sweaty. Dewy, no, dewy and I have oily fresh. skin, and I even use it. I so. like the Benetent, Benefit oh, yeah. Benetent. It's okay. like a rosy color, and uh -huh. it's perfect when it's winter because it really gives you the same look you get if you're like out in the snow, like flushed. Now we have the two tips. These are key pieces to invest in. Right. 
And it starts with a really great Western boot, which you have a Western type of boot. Yes, I just think, actually, I was thinking more of a, a higher one okay. when we were thinking of these tips. But I just think that investing in a Western-inspired boot for fall is perfect because you can really wear it with anything. I'm wearing it with a little, you know, cottony dress today. You could also tuck it into boots. You can wear it with a sweater. Tuck it into boots? Well, no, wait, tuck, it, <laughs> tuck jeans into the boots. Yeah, thank you. It's been a long night. It has been. Um, yeah, I mean, you can just do so much with it. And then what type of boots? Because I, uh, you're giving these tips. I'm like, so where do I get this? Steve, Steve Madden. Madden or, yeah. yeah. Aldo had a pair that I actually got yesterday. We showed them on the Today Show, and I was like, are oh. those in size seven? <laughs> and they were. And they're yeah. flats, not the heel boots. Yeah, well, they, they, like, have, I mean, they have a little just a heel. tiny little. It gives you like an inch of height. But it's, yeah, it makes your calves look better because yeah. a little bit of heel makes your legs, you know, and look better. To your butt. Yeah, just perks everything up a little bit. Wow. All right, good to know. And then a great blouse with detailed high neckline. So what's the difference yes. between a regular blouse and then a detailed high neckline? Is it the so, same thing? Like bows that are tied mm -hmm. right up here or any sort of embellishment is just like really in this season. We've seen it all over the runways at every single show. Did so. you call them Peter Pan collars? And then you don't have to worry about jewelry because it already has like a detail yeah, going on. If you do on. earrings, then you're like too like top heavy. I yeah. love it. So there you go, ladies and gents. What you need to know: ball tips from Ella and Blair. So are you ready to take? Yes. Yeah. So now. We're going to take a look at this haul bag that you yeah. brought today because this is exciting. All of you watching today can win this bag. And the top commenter who actually gives us their number one style tip. That so there you go. Funny. Yes. All right. So mm -hmm. what's in this bag that people are winning? So first off, we have the bag, which mm -hmm. is by Just Fab, which is can so cute. Can I pull cute. out the first thing? No. OK. I'll do this one since it's not what you were grabbing. Okay. So the first thing is one of our Solaris cases. This is one of our favorite ones. It's from our summer line. We're actually about to finished designing our fall winter line, okay. but I just think this one's so cute. And then the next thing you will get is a copy of our new novel, Beneath the Glitter. So this is a fiction book. It is. It's not like a, you know, a biography or anything. It's not a how-to, it's not a style book, it's, it's not. It's definitely loosely based on our lives. our lives. And so what can people expect from it? Drama, Adventures scandal. in love. Yeah. <laughs> So Who knew you had so much then, drama in your lives? And then we also, I don't see it in here, but I know that we're also doing a Skylark lip gloss duo. Okay. Yeah, it's in there. It I put is? it in there. We have okay. two lip glosses, oh. actually, right She's here. Like, oh, yes, they're there. So what are they're these right lip glosses? There. You want to show? You can show one, and okay. I'll show one. Don't put them on your lips, because these are gi we're giving those oh, away. Yeah. Right. But I think <laughs> I, am I wearing this? This is the Ava gloss by Skylark by Ellen Blair. And this is the Sophia gloss. They're based off the main characters in our book, Ava and Sophia London. So it's the colors that they and then the, yes. They have little birds on the top of them. That's my favorite part. Look at that, that's cute. It's a little addition. And now this bag also, you get it all in this lovely purse. Yep, this is just that bag. What is it about haul videos that everyone loves so much? I think haul videos, it's just kind of a little bit of seeing what's in this season and kind of just like, Shopping vicariously. Yeah. Shopping vicariously. And thank you so much for being here today. We so appreciate it. And to find more, just go to ellenblair.com or on their channels, Twitter, all that glitters21, and at juicystar07. I love those names. Yeah.